Hi, good morning, and welcome to today's vlog. Um, I just came back from the gym, and I am about to get settled in and do class this morning. My Korean class is resumed this week. I have four hours of class every morning, five days a week. Um, it is a lot of class, and it is pretty hard and pretty tiring, but I am learning a lot, so it's good. So I'm about to settle into class. I have that this morning, and then I am going this afternoon. I'm very excited. I am doing an office tour with Isntree, so I'm gonna be taking all of you along and showing you their office talking about some of my favorite Isn't Tree products. We have an interview with one of the members of their marketing team, which is really exciting. And then after that, I am meeting up with Helen. We are going to dinner and we are going to go see the holiday decorations all around Seoul. So the department stores here have a lot of really beautiful holiday decorations and I think it's gonna be really nice. So it's gonna be a fun day, lots going on. Let's go. Okay, so class just ended and I am going to have some lunch before I head to Isn't Tree for the office tour. Um, I ordered one of my favorite things to have for lunch. It is this chicken bowl. It has chicken, some like mixed greens and radishes, a bunch of grilled vegetables. There is squash, sweet potato, carrot, and corn. So underneath the chicken there are grains and some of the grains are like seasoned with pesto. It tastes so good. It comes with this like creamy herb dressing. I actually have no idea what it is, but it's really yummy. Oh my gosh, it's so good, this bowl. I'm obsessed with it. I always leave a little bit in the container so that I can dip the chicken in it. <laughs> okay, I got this delicious bite chicken and sweet potato. Mmm. It is so good. I don't know how they cook this chicken, but it is next level. Okay, I'm gonna finish my lunch and then we'll head out to Isn't Tree. Hey, how are you? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We're here. Hi. <laughs> okay, everyone, this is Iris. She's the marketing manager for Isn't Tree, and she's gonna be leading the first part of our tour today. So, are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. All right, let's go. Okay. Here we are. Yeah, Isn't Tree? Yeah. This is our overseas sales office. Mm -hmm. Okay. Here we have Lucy. Hi. Hi. <laughs> and he, this is supply chain uh, management team. It's our domestic Hi. marketing team. <laughs> and here we have domestic sales team. Hi. 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 This is our design team. Hi guys. Hi. <laughs> yeah, the producers, video producers. Yeah, they're making some videos on our YouTube channel. You so exciting. Subscribe. <laughs> yeah, of course. Yes. I'll add a link in the description box. <laughs> we have our lobby. We sometimes have, you no. Know, every Monday morning we have the like idea meeting. Like mm. everyone can come up here and say anything, any opinion, any creative uh, ideas. Oh. Yeah, we should, this is the place we share the ideas. <laughs> My favorite room. Yeah, this is your <laughs> room. Oh my gosh, so many amazing products. Which line is your favorite line? Oh my gosh, it's hard to choose because I have a couple. <laughs> but I love the green tea line. Uh -huh. All my viewers know this product. I talk about it all the time, the green uh -huh. tea fresh toner. It and is. then of course, the mugwort line I love, especially the ampoule mm -hmm. and the real clay mask. Clay mask, Both yeah, are that's so really good. awesome. Do you have a favorite line? Uh, yes, I do. I uh, recently I really love the onion line. Yeah. I have dry skin. It's really perfect for me. And I really love the mugwort line as well. It's so good. Like if you are able to create a line in here, like what will be for you? Oh, a new line. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> 
Well, this is gonna come as a surprise to nobody, but I would make a line for sensitive skin, like specifically uh -huh. for sensitive skin, uh -huh. with like Sika, Madacasticide, mm -hmm. maybe like Alantoin, mm -hmm. fragrance-free, very, very, very gentle, because mm -hmm. everyone knows how sensitive my skin is. So there are a lot of your products that are great, like the Soothing Ampoule is so good for soothing the skin, mm -hmm. and I love the green tea, is so gentle, and the onion line is so gentle, but I feel like a whole sensitive skin line would be Oh. Chef's kiss. Yeah. Oh, to the studio. studio. Is that a mess? <laughs> oh my gosh, not at all. Yeah. It's you know, perfect. All the studios are real mess. <laughs> this is what a creative space looks like. Yeah. When you're having creative thinking, it can't be organized. <laughs> okay, so as you all have seen, I did a little Q&A in my Instagram story asking about some questions that you all had about Isntree. So the first question that we got was, how was Isntree created? Like, what was the story of the creation of the brand? Yeah, many people asked us about it, but as you many people know that like our CEO is the first skincare ingredients blogger in Korea. Oh really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So she, he knew that like which ingredients are good for skin and which ingredients are tricky. So he wanted to make a really good product in lower price with okay. yeah with a good content. He felt that like uh, there are many brands so focusing on like just looking and advertising uh -huh. so he felt that he could make a brand with really good products with good ingredients so mm -hmm. it was a yeah moment is entry created so then the other question was is isn't she planning on making any sort of cleansing balm or mm -hmm. cleansing oil makeup remover type product well yeah like i was surprised many people asked us about it because mm -hmm. Like in Korea, the cleansing oil was not really successful, but mm. overseas c customers were uh, keep asking us to uh, coming back the <laughs> yeah, yeah. cleansing oil. So we're now we are planning to create a cleansing milk, Ooh. like vegan milk. So it's coming next year. Um, I don't know. I can like give you the details yeah. things, but. Yeah, the cleansing milk is coming back. Ooh, so exciting. So of course, one big issue that a lot of people are struggling with is mask knee. So one mm -hmm. of the questions was, do you have any products that you would recommend from Isntree for treating mask knee? I also had mask, mask knee a lot, but since I uh, started to fall in love with Mugrat, Yes. Yeah, ingredient. I also use other Mugrat mm -hmm. uh, products in, from other brands as well. Uh, yeah, I think our Mugrat products are really good for soothing and yeah, calm the irritated skin by mask. Yeah. Yes. Well, because the mask me a lot of the time is bacteria that's causing the breakouts, but it's also it the irritation from mm -hmm. having the mask moving on your face and mm -hmm. breathing and the heat. Yeah. So the mugwort, I love this one, and I talk about this with mask me pretty often because mm -hmm. the mugwort is so good because it has that soothing effect, mm -hmm. but then it also is so nice for helping to Kind of reduce those blemishes so i 100 percent agree with you yeah this one is so good for mask me so obviously there's this whole basket of amazing products but i wanted to talk about some of my favorites i'll start with the first one that i'm sure so many of you guys have already become familiar with because i talk about it all the time which is the spot saver mugwort ampoule mm -hmm. and this is great for like we were talking about mask me it's so good for soothing the skin and helping to heal those breakouts but it's also just really good for any type of irritation. So I love to use this one, like if I have maybe exfoliated a little bit too bit, a little bit too much, and my skin is feeling kind of irritated, I like to take this one with me to the gym. Like when mm. I finish working out and my skin is really like kind of hot and irritated, yes. I love to have this in my routine. Anytime I just feel like my skin needs some soothing, I love this one. It's definitely <laughs> holy grail status. The other one, that I also talk about all the time is the green tea fresh toner. Yeah, I saw your video a lot. Oh my gosh, it's so good. And I use this one a lot in the summer when it's really humid mm -hmm. because I find that what I love about the green tea is that it has those tannins in it that help to regulate the oil on the surface of your skin, but it's not harsh. It's yeah. not like overly drying or overly stripping. It actually can help to like soothe and strengthen your skin. So it's that really perfect balance of soothing, strengthening, and hydrating with the oil control. So I love this one in the summer, but it's also my like number one recommendation for anyone with combination skin. Mm, yeah. All of my friends that have combo skin, I recommend them this toner and they like can't put it down because <laughs> it's perfect for regulating the oil, but also balancing your hydration. So yeah. I love this one. And then I was really excited because yeah. when I came to visit the office, 
she revealed to me the new yeah. entire like green tea line outside of the toner including the serum the fresh serum mm -hmm. and this is amazing because it's even more hydrating than the toner yeah but that green tea is still good for helping to balance the skin and strengthen the skin and you get the antioxidant benefits mm -hmm. but for dry skin it's like oh, wow so good <laughs> so then the other ingredient that i want to talk about is bha yes and what's cool about your bha products is that you have two different options that True. are really good depending on your skin concern mm -hmm. the chestnut two percent bha liquid is the first one yeah. and this one is 2% BHA, so it's very strong, it's very potent. If you're struggling with oiliness, congestion, blackheads, this is like heavy hair. Yes, actually we created only for overseas customers because in Korea, we, like there is a limit of BHA using. Mm -hmm. So there were people asking us to create a little bit stronger BHA products, so mm -hmm. that's why we created with this. Yeah, and you did it so well because in the States, 2% BHA is really common. Yeah, that's I what think people so. really look for. So yes, yes. that was really nice. But the original one I also love, which is the Clear Skin BHA Toner. What I really love about this one is that it contains betaine salicylate instead of salicylic acid. Mm -hmm. What's nice about that is that you get that similar efficacy of the salicylic acid in terms of being oil soluble, having that small molecular size, it can get into the pores, it can decongest the skin. But the betaine salicylate is gentler and it's really, yeah, it really mild. It's nice because you have both. Yeah. So if you're really on the sensitive side, you can lean towards this one. And if you're on like the oily kind of congested side, you can lean towards the 2% and you can kind of like take your pick and see which one works best. And I also noticed something that I want to ask you about. Oh uh, yeah? This is empty, but oh. it, the, the packaging looks really different than the other packaging. Yeah. What, what is this? Like actually we are having a big project to okay. change the old packages so like we are planning to change the old packages to non-colored with easy peel level so okay. yeah, next year <laughs> so that's for like making it easier to recycle yeah it is brilliant yes. amazing the clean beauty is the goal of Eason's for yeah, next year. Yeah, you want it to be more sustainable. Yeah, sure. Okay, super yeah. cool. Yeah. Oh my gosh, well, I won't show too much because <laughs> no, no. I know it's secret. Okay, well, this is so exciting. Oh uh, yeah? Thank you so much for taking the time and sharing Thank your you. insight for and coming here. about the products and showing us your office. Cool. Okay, well, we're gonna wrap up here at the office mm -hmm. and then I'm gonna carry on with some more fun stuff this afternoon, so come along with me. And I'll also make sure to add links for all of the products that I mentioned here in the description box down below as well as a link to Isn't Tree's YouTube channel and Instagram. And thank you again. This was so much fun. <laughs> thank you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> so I just finished at Isn't Tree, which was so amazing. I have little products that I love. Got some replenishments. It was so nice to chat. The team was so kind and it's just really a wonderful brand. They're really thoughtful and considerate. And I really hope that all of you also found it useful and interesting to hear about the products and the ingredients and kind of the story behind the brand. It was really, 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 really fun to shoot. So I hope that you all enjoyed it. And yeah, we have more fun things planned for the rest of the day, so. Let's go. Okay, so I'm back home. I came home and got changed. I'm going to meet Helen. We are going to go look at holiday decorations. We're going to the latte department store in Myeongdong, which is like a big shopping district. And they have really, really, really pretty holiday lights. So we're gonna go look at those. And then we are going to have dinner. So I came home and I changed, put on a hat and just changed into like some comfier clothes. I'm gonna put on a puffer. It gets so dark so quickly these days. It's literally like, it was pitch black today by like 6.15 p.m. Like pitch black. Looks like the middle of the night. It's not even seven yet and it's so dark out, but I'm about to head out. I'm very excited. I am super hungry and I'm super excited for dinner and I'm very excited to see holiday decorations and kind of get into the spirit. So let's go. Okay, so we just got to Myeongdong. It is relatively uncrowded versus how Myeongdong used to always be. COVID has really hit it. It's a little bit sad, but it's very beautiful right now because of all the Christmas lights. I'm with Helen. Hello. Oh, hello. Oh, Vlogception. <laughs> um, and we are on our way to this noodle place that does like dandan noodles and ramen. It looks really, really good. And on the bus here, we passed the latte department store and the shinsege, and the lights looked so beautiful. So we're really, really excited. And Myeongdong looks really pretty right now too. Also, I know everybody always talks about olive young in Korea, but I'm gonna put y'all on to Shikor. So much better. The selection is so nice. It's like a little bit more premium. Olive young is more like 
It gives, I mean, it's not a drugstore because it's like a cosmetic it's like, store. It's like the Target. But there, it's like Target like, Beauty, like, yeah. Because there's a lot of like good products, but there's also a lot of like, like more like utility based products. Shakur is more like nice makeup, nice skincare. It's a little bit more like curated. So good. And Shakur has more of like the small indie K beauty brands that I really like. Um, okay, we're gonna go eat noodles. So in a very sad turn of events, the Tan Tan place that we wanted to go to apparently closes at 3 p.m. But there's a Din Tai Fung right up the street. So we're gonna go there and eat that instead. Okay, so we'll get the pork, the pork, pine mushroom and pork. Yeah, and then, and then um, the cucumber. Yeah. These things are my favorite. They're like crack. So good. So good. Are you hungry? Yeah, I'm starving. <laughs> These never get old. I wish you like, you know like those cucumbers where they like smash the cucumbers and mm -hmm. they like soaks up more flavor? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, a big chunk of that meat. It's so good. Here. Yummy. So for dessert, we have a special little chocolate chowang bao. They're so cute and tiny. Okay, we're gonna have the chocolate chowang bao. I had one just now and it was literally transformative. This is what it looks like. It's all cute and tiny. And it's like chocolate inside. I don't want it to fall. There, you can kind of see it. Yummers. Actually, pretty good. Can you really go wrong with chocolate and dough? Okay, so we finished dinner and we had those yummy little Zhang bao that had the like runny chocolate. So now we're craving hot chocolate. So we're on our way to get some hot chocolate. Okay, we're going here, very much hoping that Leonidas can hook us up with some good hot cocoa. Okay, we got hot chocolate. Wait, let's do a taste. Oh, yes. Mmm. That's really good. Mm. It's like real hot chocolate. It's really good. I saw them making it and it was literally like, melted chocolate poured into the cup. So yummy. It's so rich. I can only have like a little sip at a time. We made it. Whew. Little cloud, big wishes. Look at these little clouds with their big wishes. Helen, are you feeling the holiday cheer? And then we have the Merry Christmas walkway. We're in the Christmas walkway with our little hot chocolates. Tis the season to be joyous. Cheers to the holidays. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers to you guys. Cheers. Happy holidays, everybody. This is my favorite time of year. Yeah, that we drove by. Okay, so that was Latte. Now we are on our way to Shinsega to see the lights there. They look really, really, really beautiful as well. Let's go! We are crossing the street via underpass. 
because I want to get a closer look at the Shinsega lights. They're so pretty. So, in the warmer weather months, this is normally a fountain. But now it's this beautiful light display right next to Shinsega. On the bus, going home. It's been a successful day of holiday cheer. Would you agree, Helen? I hope that you all enjoyed seeing all the holiday decorations. I am gonna go home and sleep. See you in my next video. Bye!